Past Perfect's browse function is available for both collection and contact records. Browsing gives you the ability to see your records in an easy to read grid, allowing you to scroll through and find a specific record. This video will explain how to set up and sort your browse fields. From the main menu, click on Objects. To change the order that items on your browse screen sort, use the Sort By option in the upper right corner of the catalog record. Currently, Sort By is set to Object ID. When we click on Browse from the navigation bar, we see all items in the objects catalog listed in Object ID order. Close out of Browse and change the Sort By option to Object Name. Go back into Browse. This time, our items are displayed alphabetically by object name. In this example, we have two columns of information, object ID and object name. To add more columns, exit the Browse screen and then close the object record so that you are back at the main menu. From the main menu, click on Setup and then Browse. On the left side of the screen, you can select which area of the program to set the browse screen for. We'll remain in objects. The fields on the far right of the screen are the currently selected fields. The fields in the center of the screen are the fields you can add to the browse screen. Add a term by double clicking on it. There is no limit to how many fields you can add. Let's add collection and date. Once you've added your fields, exit this screen so you're back at the main menu. Go back into Objects. Click Browse. There are now additional columns for collection and date. If you have any questions about setting up or using browse fields, please call us at 1-800-562-6080. Further information about setting up your browse screens can also be found in Chapter 3 of the Past Perfect 5.0 User Guide.